All right, good evening, folks. Good afternoon, good morning, wherever you happen to be. We're actually 146 in queue for Wayfinder. Hey, we're into the double digits. Oh my god. So. We may be in soon. Let me just go brag about this to one of my friends. It's amazing. It's only been a solid week since I actually won. Oh my god, are we in? Traveling to the gloom. What? Now, I actually did get through part of the tutorial at one point. What is happening? This, is this real? Escape from the gloom. Wow, this, this is actually happening. We're playing Wayfinder. I don't believe it. Okay, escape from the gloom. We're we're actually playing Wayfinder. I'm I, I don't quite know what to say right now. Okay, we get a boss or something like that. Oh, this game does have bosses. It's also really loud. Okay, so that guy's dead. This is going to be further than I've ever gotten in this game. Right, this is where it's always crashed on me before. And looking like it's good to again. Oh, no, wait, wait. 
The purple bar is filling up. Okay, so we have like an overworld town. Oh god, that's doing... Ah, ha, ha. Okay, so this game really doesn't like that. Oh, you think that that's full screen, do you? Oh, how wrong you are. Excuse me while I manually move windows around that this game has jacked up. And try to figure out what the hell this is. It <sighs> What is this nonsense game? What is this? There we go. Good lord. Whoa, what is that stuff? Wow, this game's optimization is apparently real bad. I already know part of what's dragging that down in an early access game like this. Yeah. Shadow quality. Foliage. And... Motion blur. Okay. Does this game have... Well, it's got FSR, but... Let's see if that helped any. No! It made things worse. Right, talk to Omen. Also, I could finally turn this game's volume down a little bit. All right. Yeah. 
It is so good to see you again. I thought we'd lost you forever. Don't worry. Your memories will return in time. That battle took place a year ago, and you were lost in the gloom. We've been trying to bring you back ever since. Let me show you. The Eldrin attack was okay. a distraction. The beacon was always the target. Was it now? We pushed past them and found the creature who was leading the attack. And you did what needed to be done. You fought to the bitter end. And your sacrifice bought me the time we needed. There's so much we don't yet know about the beacon. But its power protects this city. It destroyed our enemies and stopped the gloom tear from expanding. We couldn't close the gloom gate. But as long as the beacon remains lit, our enemies can't pass through it. And in the year that followed, we've studied it. Learned more about this gloom. Learned how to bring you back. We survived thanks to you. But the damage is done. Skylight is safe and the land around it. But beyond the highlands, reality is collapsing into the gloom. That seems really, really bad, Jack. There may Jack. be other beacons, other places that repel the invaders. The only way to find out is to cut a path through the gloom. And for that, we need wayfinders. We need you. Okay. Your sacrifice, and that of the others, bought me the time I needed to light the beacon. And the beacon's light holds the gloom at bay. It's the only reason we're alive. We still don't know. A year ago, the Eldrin attacked us and extinguished the beacon. Mm -hmm. And it was then that the gloom began to spread. It corrupts and consumes reality. So it's bad. The beacon protects us. But beyond its light, the gloom has swallowed the world, leaving only shadows and chaos. We don't know if anyone else has survived. That's why we need you. You okay. survived in the gloom. You can do it again. With the tools you've been given, you can cut through its shadows. You must be a wayfinder. We still know so little about the gloom. You've been through an ordeal. I shouldn't burden you with this now. You were a seeker once. You've just forgotten. Before the gloom fall, we investigated ancient mysteries. Now it's the seekers who will go to the Great Hall, up above the plaza. Okay, so now we're going to get our intro quest. I really do like the art style of this game. It's pretty. Welcome, Wayfinder. You honor us with your presence. I fought the Eldrin during the attack, just as you did. But it was your sacrifice that saved Skylight. Wolf, before the fall, I was an officer of the Avar Imperium. Now I command our forces, such as they are. There are all too many threats, shrikes, breaches. But you'll see for yourself soon enough. I bet I will. We'll have much to discuss in the days ahead. And we'll have quarters for you soon enough. Much of Skylight was devastated in the attack. The builders are working as quickly as they can. You have more important work ahead of you. But for now, find Lord Halar outside of the Great Hall. He'll get you ready for the tasks that lie ahead. Okay. So Lord Halar, is it? Delightful. I am Lord Halar. As you know, my lands and the Dominion itself have been swallowed by the gloom. But even now, especially now, names matter. Do they? I lead the Arcanists among the Seekers. By necessity, we have focused our efforts on restoring Skylight. But it is my studies of the gloom that can help you. 
not my knowledge of arcanic illumination. All right. Okay, tell me more. Is that the gloom alters flora and fauna, and never for the better. Where it lingers, it <coughs> will consume entire <coughs> regions, leaving only shadows in the gloom. What we call lost zones. Lost you zones, got it. Consumed by the gloom, but you survived. Now you have the power to shape it, to some degree. The shard you've been given focuses this gift. Right. Only a wayfinder can enter a lost zone. But this is just a glimmer of your full potential. If you can enforce your will upon the gloom, perhaps one day we can undo the damage that has been done. I doubt it. I can only tell you of the gloom. Omen can show you. Return to her near the gloom gate, Wayfinder. She will guide you in the next steps of your journey. Okay. Spoken with Wolf and Lord Halar. I am sure you have. The gloom is consuming our world. Our beacon holds. Using the focusing shard, you can pass through breaches to reach us. We're running out of time. The gloom is great. Okay. We do know the large gate behind me is the key. In theory, you can reach any lost. Usually, you must find and enter a breach directly to access a lost zone for the first time. Okay. But you can't just stumble into a breach. You need a connection to the lost zone to guide you through it. Okay. This might mean, for now, I have a single connection I can share with you. The Codex Halls of Aurelian. There. The shard you've been using is an incomplete tool. Find a Codex Ember in the gloom. Then we can trap... Alright, so now we have a quest called Into the Unknown. Enter the runes through the gloom gate. This is the part that makes me nervous, is am I going to keep my connection when I travel? This is a lost zone. It's not a perfect replica of the world that was. It's a dream inspired by what was lost. When you return here again, everything, the layout, the creatures within it, may change. Okay, procedural generation. This lost zone is tied to Aurelian, a fortress monastery of the Avar Order of the Silver Codex. The Codex monks were conducting arcane research, and we need to know more about them. Aurelian was raised by raiders from the maze years before the Gloomfall. You'll need to establish your own connection to it. Okay, weaker than that was before? It was a miracle that we could pull you back to Skylight. But like your memories, some of your skills were lost. Don't worry. It will all come back to you in time. This connection I've provided is temporary and unpredictable. Look for a Codex Ember. Mm -hmm. With it, you can turn your shard into a full gloom dagger and establish your own connections. I can't guide you when you go deeper. To escape... You'll need to find the heart of this lost zone, the anchor, and destroy it. This weakens the gloom and lets us harvest its energy through your shard. Explore as thoroughly as you can. We need the supply. Okay. I'm assuming there won't be a whole lot to this first one.
Aha. Oh no, my foes grow stronger. Whatever shall we do? Okay, so that's just wrapped around. Is that it? Okay. What is this? Something new. Something interesting. I hear an echo in the darkness. You have promised. And you're yes, who again? But you don't have what I need. Not yet. Okay, Go creepy ahead. voice. Run along home. I'll be watching you, Wayfinder. Imbue with greed energy, convert Gloomstone into aspect, bo aspect boosts and perks in the character aspect affinity menu. Okay. I'm starting to see why the server problems were giving them so many fits, because everything is instanced every time you travel. Yes, let's get to work. Whatever we're going to do. The Silver Codex studied ways to manipulate arcane energies. We can use... You see, the shard you claimed in the gloom is a rough and imperfect tool. A blade that can cut through reality. Okay. To combine the ember and the shard. Visualize the... Sh
perfectly done. Woven from the pure elements of magic. And to reach a lost zone, you a need brief three things. For the glim dagger. A okay. brief connection can take the form of an object, such as the ember now bound. You now have a gloom dagger, and through the ember, you have a connection to the code. Yes, just so. You need to find the port. Once you've found it, use your dagger to carve a path. There you are. Your gloom dagger is connected to the beacon of Skylar. A voice in the gloom. No, that wasn't me. I warned you that the connection would be unstable. Remain alert. But I'm sure it was just Lord Halar and I spent much of this last year refining. But now, I need you to return to the Codex Halls. We need to know more about the work of the Silver Codex. Our work suggests no, they were never peaceful ages. With a sinister force that may have been the gloom decades before the gloom fall. As Lord Halar has told you, you must before you leave Skylight. I need you to bind your daggers to the signal fires here. This will once that's done. Take the lift down to the Highlands and find. Your limbs working it. Oh. Oh. All right, well, let's go interact with the signifier in the market. Near the Great Lift, you say? Very grandiose name. It better be a really cool lift. Except the servers hold. So yeah, this this is interesting now that it's finally working, guys. I'm curious what characters people are playing. Uh, I know that Looney was going to look at the um, paladin-looking guy. And there's the guy with the gun. Plus there's the other ones that you can unlock with the different packs. So I'm curious who else playing this and who's taking who else. Oh, that's interesting. Well met, Wayfinder. Welcome back to the world. What's left? You'll find out soon enough, I fear. 
Hmm. Brigands and looters. Some of them half feral, looking for the breach. I'm no wayfinder. Head past the foundry to the ring here. Head out past the foundry. Be sure to bind your dagger to the signal fire here. You'll find them across the high. Again, I'm no wayfinder. I've heard they're connected to the beacon. On your way then. But we could use another blade out. Skylight needs supplies. And it's getting harder. As a wayfinder, you alone can chart a path to the many will ask for your help. And I right now I need you to return to the Caesar. Okay. Baby. Okay. Right. Okay, so we killed some of them. Goodbye. Mm. All right, well, I see a stone to interact with. Ah, oh, they're nice and obvious on the map, too. Good, good. Don't want anything to do with that, apparently.
Okay. See, I've absolutely lost some of my powers. Gotcha. A previous expedition discovered unnatural deadly unnatural spiders. Deadly in spiders. Of Did the okay. Codex somehow harness the glue? You aren't the only wayfinder. You'll Interesting. Oh, nope, found a party apparently. She makes her voice comes her off. Oh God. Okay, so we're actually in with a party. Hey, level three. Yay. What's up with the gelatinous cube? Oh, 
Alright, so there's a lot to explore and find around here. Like, a lot of stuff. And then another chest. No, my foes grow stronger. Feature coming soon, of course. Alright, well, we can travel now. And let's see what we got out of this. Interesting. I really don't mind the concept of a randomized dungeon runner, guys. That <laughs> just... That does sound fun. All right, traveling to the highlands. <clears throat> so, maybe now we get to look at how the uh, fast travel system works. Because up until now, we've just been unlocking the beacons and haven't really had a need to use it. But I don't want to walk all the way back, so this will be a good chance to figure that out. I might not want to fast travel that switches server instances.
Okay, so that's where we can equip items. Abilities, there it is. My active abilities made it for you and one weapon ability. Okay. Five or nine, okay. Ah, so these have individual levels as well. All right, then. Okay, so there's a lot. Let's see about this recovering stolen supplies stuff, since we're right here. Another one right up here. Whoa. Oh, big chest. Requires a skeleton key, huh? Oh, that's interesting. Okay, then. those guys well, now that's not so bad with that ability I like that 
does a lot of damage for just a um, dodge ability. Alright. Well, let's go talk to the warden since we finished this, see if we can get some more XP. Yep, your resource management quest is done. Cool. Alright, switching instances again. But not so sure about that, honestly. If we get kicked, I'm not waiting in queue again, so we just have to hope we don't get kicked. style is certainly pretty. I'm still kind of trying to get to grips with the rest of the game, but the art style is really nice. One moment, Wayfinder. I need to balance the arcanic pressure in this file. Yes. Yes. These creatures were altered with arcanic power. Isn't the random work of the gloom. The codex were monks of the Imperium. They couldn't have done this. Even if they knew how, working with the element of shadow isn't Wayfinder. You must find the source of this. The gloom is a maelstrom of shadows mm -hmm. and chaos. Anchors pull together visions of what might have been. Fragments of the whole. But you can do more than this. With your these webs hold traces of a greater threat. I can isolate its spore. I can give you what you need to hunt. Each has something you need. Okay. Tools you can use. Arsenal can arm you. The engineer can... I'm gonna let that get uh, tutorialized later. I'm not... Get to start into that system right away. Arsenal, you say? He won't deal in weapons now, will he? I see a wayfinder, newborn from the void. You are Skylight's fist, child. You need a weapon worthy of a legend. Eclipse, we drew you forth from the gloom when you were lost. You can do the same. It is no simple thing to find a weapon in the gloom and mock. Cannot craft any items. Oh god, it's a little gnome thing. Good! <laughs> it's hard to get supplies in what's left of the world, but my friends and I comb the broken. Have you come to dream? No, I have not. 
You are newly returned, yes? You may find my appearance unsettling, but there is power within you. Accessories will help you. The greatest accessories cannot simply be crafted. All power has... Alright, let's look at our quest, because I feel like we just... Yeah. You need the form, the spirit, the essence, and the shell. Craft a basic arcanic elixir at Venge, okay? Potions are used for snooze. Okay. Go get her and use many potions. Oh, God. Now, I can't do the legendary weapon thing. All right, chat, we're going to take a quick... Well, the time out of this game is like five minutes, actually. So we can't really take a quick break. friends on the day of the fall it's not easy to pull a wayfinder from the gloom we need to find the echoes of the hero and use the beacon to create a path they can follow but together we can bring them back there are things i need you to find mm -hmm. elements of power traces of our fallen champions we need more wayfinders if we are to survive all right back to lord what's his face successful. I've drawn the essence from the webs and found the trace, but before you reach her, you must craft a gloom trace and use it on the gloom gate. I will provide the materials you need this once. Once made, the gloom trace will guide you directly to your prey. I believe we may be able to use craft the gloom trace and then go to the... Alright, 
Speak to Ruby in Skylight. Okay. So, up and over here, and... Oh. Okay. I have an apartment, apparently. Travel to Skylight Apartments. Sure. Okay. Yay. I'm not real sure about the whole apartment thing, but whatever. So you just gotta have housing in a the game these days. Let's see about this gloom trace nonsense. Actually, whew. it is time for a very quick break. Be back in just a minute.
craft, craft the gloom trace, you say, game. Into the brood mother's lair, you say. Oh yeah, we can do bad things with the camera. Let's see what this does for us. Let's see what's down here. Oh, there's the brood mother. Spider, lovely.
Oh, we have a third all of a sudden. Trickster Key, Gloomstorm Shard, and Silver Spectre. Alright, so... Got some experience for our weapon and for us. Not quite level 4. Let's get out of here. Alright. And again, paranoid time, because this is where we're going to lose connection. If we're going to lose it. So, is this your favorite game? Hardly. This game has not been out long enough for me to call it my favorite game. In fact, this is the first time I've actually been able to play it since it uh, launched and we had they had all their horrible server problems. In fact, we're not even a week out from launch, and this is the first time I've been able to play it. Where am I from? Some place in the United States. A stone. Yes. And where yes. are you from, if I can ask? If this is what I think it is. What? It could change everything. The facets, the fragments, glimmers of gloom and chaotic currents. G give me a moment to study it. The stone that you found in this room, mm -hmm. it's a sort of a, a, elemental lens, a tool designed to shape the gloom itself. The gloom is a myriad of possibilities, and this stone... Well, how can I explain it? What do you do besides stream? Well, I have my YouTube channel, and I do a variety of other things besides that. The gloom is fundamentally that. unstable. It's said that the celestial architects shaped our world from primordial chaos. I believe that the gloom may be that primal. Get a little ahead of ourselves, aren't we here, Lord the Halar? Stone lets you shift between myriad potential realities, but how to use it? It's going to take a surge of elemental power. Yes, perhaps your dagger. There it is. I was waiting on the Sawama designer part. I've treated the myriad stone. Take it to the Echo Matrix and fuse it to your dagger. Let's see what comes of it. Imbuement Matrix. Okay, that's what we're crafting. Bring the augmented dagger to Omen, not Lord Halar. Summon Wayfinders, huh? Let us see. Oh, yes. This is a fascinating tool. I can smooth out the connection. Lord Halar is a brilliant arcanist, but he doesn't understand what you truly are. I should have told you sooner, but I didn't know how to say it. You see, my friend, you didn't survive our battle against the Eldren. You gave your life to save Skylight. You perished and were consumed by the gloom. For anyone else, that would have been the end. But you refused to let go. You lingered as an echo, holding on until I found you and sent the shard. Okay. I gave you the tool you needed. But you imposed your will upon the gloom. You rebuilt your body, 
And you can do it again if you fall in battle. Mm-hmm. And I believe that's only the beginning. The dagger focuses your power. Sure now can. bound to the stone, our architects have fallen. All right. So I feel like we got... This is kind of the this end of the main tutorial palace. quest. Um, I appreciate it, Kylie, but I have a designer already. The skills you've had to relearn. You're an echo of my You're welcome family. to try my I Discord and see if anybody else design. needs any work. You can shape the gloom. It's how you craft your weapons, how you return from defeat, how you bind the echoes of your enemies to gain strength. Now you can shape the gloom itself. You'll need to imbue your dagger with concentrated elemental energy. When you cut a path into the gloom, that energy should reshape the lost zone, creating a unique layer of reality. So I guess I need to fix a window here. My god, that got really screwed up. There we go. I have a charge of elemental shadows. Imbue your dagger with this power. Okay. So, start a Codex Halls expedition using a shadow imbuement. Select spheres to adjust difficulty in a plan imbuements to create. Okay. Okay. So we can customize them. Excellent. Like I said, I've got a designer, but we do have other creators in the community, so. So one more level to unlock some other abilities. We don't have any other wayfinders yet, so. Come on, give me a server. Connection error. Nope. Nope. Well, we just got kicked. It was fun while it lasted. 